welcome back to the channel viewers uh, this uh, video is um, a video about um, a trip that we did on um, in Negros Negros is the big island we live on um, and it's called the Negros loop so there's a group of people in the Philippines motorcycle riders called loopers so they're not loopy as in crazy they're loopers they what they do is they they ride around um, different islands in the Philippines and go on different um, you know, journeys through all the islands. So this this one was down in Negros. So we went along for a ride with them. Um, never been on a Negros or any loop before, so um, contemplated doing it. Um, you can join up these loops if you go onto Facebook. You can um, join and I think pay fifty dollars American, roughly twenty five hundred pesos, and they give you a T-shirt, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. We didn't do that. Just uh, me and my buddy. Robert um, just thought we'd jump on the bikes and um, go for a ride and just see what it's all about. So we started off in Dumaguete, you saw on the maps in the beginning, and we, we rode up, up, um, oh, sorry, south. We rode south and then up the west coast of Negros. So we stopped at a place called um, Shiaton, S-I-A-T-O-N, pretty popular place. Lots of people come from there. You meet him in Dumaguete, where are you from? Shiaton. So we stopped there, and that was the first meeting point. So... Uh, there's a few bikes there. You'll see um, some bikes passing us on the road, on on the footage, and they are all wearing their their uh, Negros Loop vests. So that's one way, you know, these um, bright vests that identify them as loopers. Um, so, yeah, so we called in there, had a look, and then on the road on the way up, um, lots of kids waiting on the side of the road, you know, with um, signs saying, you know, Jet Li, um, you know my my idol and so lots of kids screaming and waving and it was really great atmosphere so Jet Li if you look her up Google Jet Li is one of the famous uh, Filipino female motorcycle riders so um, yes yeah, they were waiting for her on the side of the road and uh, if you look at her Jet Li and then the Negros loop you'll see lots of footage um, not on this channel but other other you know if you go on to google you see all the footage of her she's pretty famous so we didn't get to see her but we just went along for the ride so um as i'm speaking we're we're calling into shiatan um to the first little car park and there'll be some bikes zooming past us on the left in a second i think and then yeah there they go and um the riders the riders out on the road they're all different you know types of riders some ride like a bat out of hell you know they're really quick all sorts of different bikes, you know, big bikes or smaller bikes. Um, it was just a great, great atmosphere. So sit back, enjoy the footage, and I'll, I'll play some music, and you can just um, indulge with us. And really nice roads. We go up to a place called Sipali, which is very famous. If you ever come over this way and visit Sipali, beautiful beaches down in Sipali or up in Sipali. And then we went to Kambunkalan and all different places. And then we ended up in Bacolod. Bacolod's about five hours from Dumaguete. Depends which way you go. But it's a beautiful city right up the top of uh, Negros. So Negros is into two parts. Negros Oriental and then Negros Occidental. So up in Bacolod, they talk a different lingo. They talk Ilongo. And down south where we are, they talk Basaya. So sit back and enjoy the footage. And hope you enjoy.
nothing to it If you concentrate, we will see you through it Don't forget, at the end of the ride You'll be hypnotized by the sun is too late Hope you're enjoying this so far, viewers. We just passed over into Negros um, Occidental. So there's the imaginary border in Negros, you know, it's divided. Oh, here we are, actually. We're passing over into it now. Um, some kids over on the right-hand side waiting for Jet Li, and so we give them a wave. Um, the crowds get bigger and bigger and bigger, and all these kids wanting stickers and everything, but great atmosphere. They just really supported this, uh, all the loopers, as they say, as they're riding around Negros. Um, magnificent um, weather, no rain or anything like that, so it's good. The roads are pretty good um, overall. So, yeah, we come up to another place called Sipoli. Now, Sipoli, gorgeous place. So I think we're going to turn left here and we're going to go into Sipoli. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get any footage of the beach at Sipoli, but it's a beautiful white sand beach. Um, we're down, down in uh, Dumaguete area, Darwin, all of that area. They're sort of black sand beaches. But up further up in Nurgross, they're white sand beaches. So just a bit of trivia. But we'll have a look here as we get in. Yeah, we're just pulling in now. And um, the officials are there to greet everybody at each checkpoint. It's pretty warm at this time of the day. But you can see you can see the you know coconut trees in the over there in the beach. So over yonder. Unfortunately, as I said, I didn't get the footage or I didn't include the footage of the beach here but that's Sipoli so make sure you visit there and then from there we just headed further up um, up up north so um, I'll get back into the music I hope you're enjoying it and uh, we'll go from there well there you go viewers so 
we're getting closer to the end destination up at Bacolod, and um, you'll see in the footage just coming up that we're we're um, coming into the where the where the you know the main um, loopers meet at the end of the the um, the trip. So really well organised. Um, I've got some video coming up a little bit later or two with uh, we met the actual organisers. So that was a bit of a treat, and the guy rides a Peugeot 400 CC, the first one in the Philippines. So, really nice guy. Um, we talked to him about the whole, you know, process and the the looping and all that sort of stuff. So, yeah, sit back and watch. Okay, viewers, so we're walking around a little bit, doing a bit of filming, meeting lots of friendly uh, people there, and some of the guys up here getting their photos taken uh, on their bikes, you know, with the background of the Negros Loop, which you'll be able to see, 2023, there it is. Some nice bikes, you know, all different types of bikes. These Filipinos love their motorbikes. Um, here's a 1000 CC. This guy's a nice guy too, you know, he's... Uh, Oh, he's wearing the jacket, the loop jacket with all the sponsors on it, but um, I think it's a, a V-Strom, uh, 1,000cc V. Oh, no, actually, it's a 650 V-Strom, so it's not the big one. But, yeah, this gets packed later on. So I've got some footage later on um, in the evening. It's just chockers, chock-a-block full of um, people and more bikes and, you know, there's all awards and everything. So, yeah, sit back and watch.
I told you it would be busy there at the, all the awards. They were actually giving away bikes that night. So in front of me, these are the the organisers, the the couple of big guys here, the guy in the grey sh um, sh um, shirt. He does a lot of the organisers and he, he's, um, he's got a really nice um, Peugeot um, 400cc. So I'll show you some footage of that. That's brand new, the only one in the country. So sit back and enjoy this one. Welcome back to the channel, viewers. We've got a first here. It's a Peugeot 400cc, first in the Philippines. Look at this. This is beautiful. Upside down forks. Look at the wire wheels. That is a nice scooter. 400cc. Wow. Looks like it's got risers on the handlebars. That's nice. Had a bit of a hiccup at the back, but that's good. That's a good looking bike. Wow. How much are these? 500. 550,000 pesos. Here's the owner. What's up, you guys? Hey, hey, hey. The, uh, the, these know. guys, by the way, are the organizers of the Philippine Loop. No, um, Loop Philippines. Oh, Loop, Loop Philippines. Philippines. So we're yeah, very proud to meet them. And uh, this is his bike, the, the 400 Fuso. Very nice bike. All right, that's just a quick update from Bacolod City. And uh, we'll catch you soon. Well, viewers, uh, here's the map on the way back. So we went up the west coast. Now we're going across from Bacolod to Negros, uh, over to San Carlos, and then back down to Dumaguete. Nice trip. Um, we got pretty much oh, up to the mountain area, and then it, it looked pretty on ominous, the weather. So um, we donned uh, wet weather gear, and it absolutely bucketed down for a few hours. So road, so that was a, a tricky one. We got to San Carlos, and you'll see the last bit of footage. It was absolutely bucketing down. So good fun. Um, all, all fun in the Philippines. So hope you enjoyed it and um, I'll catch you next time.